remember two years ago when this all started with more than 200 nations staking their claim to be top of the world. Well, 32 made it to the finals here, and after a tournament spanning the better part of a month, featuring endless football on almost every day, it is a straight fight now for the title of the world's best. It has been a great festival of friendship, of sportsmanship so far, and one, we hope, which will end with a flourish. The Stadio Olimpico, a venue that has an old-school feel about it. We stand for the national anthem of France. Well, that was impressive. Match that. do wonder what might be going through the minds of these players ahead of this game of games, the very pinnacle of the world game. Well, when it's this big, Peter, you're having an extra word with yourself in trying to ensure you make the best start you possibly can. Do your bit for the team without any mistakes. We've seen that tense edge during the lineup, so start as you mean to go on strongly. So what are we to expect in this final? As with a lot of finals, caution plays a big part in the opening stages, but an early goal can blow all that away, so I hope that we can um, create a, a, an attacking contest here, which, which obviously we want for this showpiece. He's through. Questions were asked. And he's given the answers. Hernandez. Who's ball? Who's going to get that? And it's Dembele. Griezmann. Mbappe. Rabio. Griezmann. And here. Something big. Oh, high quality goal, lovely first touch, sumptuous second. Big occasion, big goal, crucial lead. Well, Peter, the emphasis should now switch to winning it rather than even thinking about losing it. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Good run, ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. Crowd appreciates good football all round there. Turns and goes back. And here's Dembele. Dembele goes for the cross. Hits one! Needless to say, he was expecting a better ball than that. Argentina are already trailing here early on. They cannot afford to let this get worse. Well, it can be very hard to regroup and work your way back into the match, but they've got time. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. 
uh, was too timid to make it through the defence. It'll be noted and, and improved upon, I'm sure. Griezmann loses his balance and loses the ball. Talia Fico brings it forward. Away from immediate danger, and that's been one straight back. Giroud, Mbappe. Tries to get it forward quickly. Talia Fico, that's a decent ball. Well positioned to make that interception. That a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. Needed a better pass there. Rabio. Mbappe provides an outlet. Rabio! It's off target and by quite a way. Well, that's why we all say indecision is fatal. Forward it goes. A long ball, but not especially accurate. Mbappe. Rabio. Shoots! Rabio quickly realized that he could have a pop, not his best. Approaching half time and still behind. They make something happen now. Talia Fico. Ball through needs to be good here. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Dembele. Now it's Giroud. It's Giroud! Just a whisker away. And that's exactly the type of adventure we want to see in a final two, Peter, and it's a pity it didn't cause the net to bulge. Dembele, who does have an assist to his name. Hit into the middle. Good take by the keeper, he's read that well. Well, there's the whistle. The first half of the final has flown by. And here we are, off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. So we've had the first 45 minutes of the final, Jim. That's surely a foul free kick. Rafael Varane, and it's Griezmann. Hernandez, and he has been fouled there. <laughs> Defending was strong and firm. They've been denied a chance to develop any rhythm in the passing department. Dembele. Griezmann. Dembele. Plays it out to the flank. Griezmann. Rabio. Dembele. Finds himself eased off the ball. Gets it back. Up for a throw. Done 
very well to intervene. Rafael Varane. Hernandez drives it forward. And here's Dembele. Griezmann. Argentina still trailing by one. And looking here to take it up a notch after the break. Otamendi battles to win it back. And it's Rabio. Messi. Good running with the ball. Can they build on it? Well, it's good stuff. This is better. Jim, there's not too much subtlety or sophistication about this. It really is a question of needs must. Spot on, Peter. Dembele pings it out wide. Giroud. Dembele. Defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Well, you could see he was eager to get a shot away, but there was too much flesh and bone in his path. Dembele. Goes for goal! Oh, what a wonderful stop! Dembele is very sporting here to acknowledge the quality of the save. A lovely little footballing moment. Gets it back. Talia Fico. Tried to play it through. The movement was good, but the pass lacked authority. Uh, a cause of mild frustration. And it's Dembele. Griezmann. Balls come loose, and the chase is on. France get it back again. Argentina are looking desperate here, short on time and options. They need something heroic now, or a lucky break, or a kind refereeing decision. Anything. Into the middle. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. minutes left on the clock and it's played forward Hernandez Rafael Varane Griezmann plays it forward France probably could have killed things off but they should be okay here now it's Giroud. Right through the middle. Giroud. And the shot! The final whistle and the end. Argentina fall at the final hurdle. They gave it everything, but it was a bridge too far. And so it ends in pain as the glory goes elsewhere. So much endeavour, so much expectation.